Hi, I'm Andrew. And I'm Grace. And we're from the Santa Barbara Middle School Teen Press, and we're here with... Katie Pofall. And Mark Shelley. How did you find the story? Uh, well, we, we were approached by someone uh, that had the idea to make a film about sea otters. And uh, we do films about nature and conservation issues. And uh, sea otters seemed like a pretty good animal to make a film about. And I said immediately, yes, we would do it. And from there, we developed the story and, and then had the idea to cast a young lady to tell the story. So that's where we found Katie. Um, so our Teen Press tagline is Dreamers Who Do. When you were a teenager, what was a dream that you wanted to do in the future? Ooh, that is a good, deep question. <laughs> a dream that I wanted to do in the future was work with animals. That was always my number one goal hanging out with animals, I would be happy for the rest of my life. So um, that turned into, you know, I really like animals, but not all of them are happy and safe. So what I'm going to do to work with animals is take care of them. So my goal, you know, became protecting animals and the habitats that they live in and, and teaching people about things that they can do to help animals, you know, be healthy and happy in the places that they live. Mm -hmm. yeah. And I was a swimmer as a kid, and uh, swimming wasn't something you could sort of major in and do as a profession, uh, but swimming led to going underwater into the ocean, and all of a sudden, through kind of being good underwater, I got introduced to animals and biology and marine biology, and so I guess my swimming drove me into marine biology. Are sea otters the only animals that like you observe and study? Them? Mm, right now, I only have eyes for sea otters, but um, truth be told, I am interested in most every animal. I um, have done research on salmon, on um, all sorts of freshwater fish, on minnows, on, um, on squirrels, on mice, lizards, ticks, bacteria, lots of, you know, planaria, all sorts of weird animals that, um, you know, are also equally fascinating, but not all as fluffy and cute. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. So I think it really worked how you did it through Facebook. Cool. Um, how'd you get the idea to do that? Ooh, you know, I think that's a Mark question. Yeah, you know, the, um, the idea was to tell a story for people your age. And, you know, I have a 10-year-old daughter, and I was noticing that she was looking at Facebook kind of a lot and texting and those things. And so I wanted to tell the story for people your age, and I thought maybe we'd tell the story using the tools that you use to communicate with each other. And so that's where the Facebook idea came up. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you.